And welcome back to the interesting and frustrating world of Hitman World of Assassin or World of Frustrating Assassin Nations. Um this first stream uh if we make it um Silent Assassin we will continue include the stream after that so it can be uploaded onto YouTube in its entirety um I want to show you guys real quick a contract I made earlier today uh, I started working on it yesterday uh, totally scrapped it and then I came up with a new idea earlier today uh, timing might be kind of difficult because I ended up going to sleep at 8 p.m. Woke up at midnight, so there's my mandatory four hours of insomniac sleep. Because as an insomniac, I, no matter how tired I am or what the fuck I got planned, like I only because of insomnia and anxiety like I only get four hours of sleep so I'm up uh, so technically it was yesterday not today because it is one o'clock in the morning now I've been up since midnight uh, got four hours of sleep wish I could have slept at least four hours more so technically I did this yesterday came up with the original idea the day before yesterday scrapped it came up with a different idea so technically I shouldn't say yesterday because it's still in the same 24 or 12 hour period either way uh, I did this a couple hours ago uh, before I went to sleep um, ran it the first time no problem uh, ran it the second time. Now, I didn't stream getting Silent Assassin the second time. Uh, because actually, I was actually kind of worried about this after I completed it. And I don't like to fail a bunch of times and have it on the same video, so. Um,. I hope I can get this down one or two tries, but uh, close shave. Here's the requirements you may need to do. Uh, briefing, 47, can you get close enough to shave these wolves den operators without being noticed? We have Meryl Krantz, Mesimuni Execution, Board Member Disguise, Angus Pritchard, Fall Accident, The Board Member. If you're not that well versed in Kong King or as I should see or as I should say King Kong might as well um, those two words reversed uh, Pritchard is the board member so we have to kill him in his own suit um, Raimundo Alfano Scissor Execution board member um, Boris Lacano, Lacayo, Hobby Knife Melee, or Hobby Knife Elimination as the board member. Clevy Stop, Tonto Elimination, or Execution via board member. Required Exit, do not get spotted. Nobody's found. 
Headshots only. If you shoot at an NPC and miss the head, you immediately fail the mission. Targets only. Now I set it up so there's no... Um... What is that? Op so it's not optional. At all. And there is a certain degree of difficulty. So... This is somewhere in between... A class and B class difficulty. In terms of... Strategy to be used, eliminations to be used, or just overall degree of difficulty. So, I set this up to either be A class or B class, depending on how good you are. So, we got we already have to bring a Master Mooney, which, um. Already sets us, sets us uh, one inventory slot down. But after I made this contract, I realized that even though it is a difficult, um, difficult contract uh, there really isn't anything that I need to bring in other than the gas grenade um, I even brought a lockpick in uh, on the second playthrough for the uh, scoreboard and realized that uh, I didn't even need a lockpick. Most of the uh, locks on here are electronic, so they need a passcode. And with a certain tool I can pick up on site, uh, I don't need a lockpick. So. But, the Tonto knife is not natural to your inventory. Um, you have to complete level 5 of Hawk's Bay. It's only 5 levels. Uh, I'm still on level 4 for it. Um... So I have to pick it up on site for now. And instead of just cutting some of the difficulty out, um, I want to show you how difficult it can be. Uh, the original time was 31 minutes. The second time was 12 minutes. I believe I, I think maybe 15 minutes overall best time. Um, yep, 1940 is my second time. Uh, but, uh, original time was 31 minutes. Um, my second playthrough And my first after completing, for, uh, so I can get my score on the leaderboard, uh, is 19 minutes. So I cut that down 11, 12 minutes, somewhere in there. Um, and one, once I can unlock the Tonto for the inventory, that will con that'll cut it down considerably. Probably another five minutes, depending. Um... But here we go. So I don't need to bring we'll bring we'll bring coins in. We'll do that. There there's only a couple I could find on site. 
So we might we might as well do that. Uh It's funny, you can unlock different coins, but they're basically just the same thing with a different skin on them. Go with the gold coin. Now, if anybody knows, uh, coins have been a staple since blood money, as far as I remember. Um, I think they were accessible in Absolution. That's, that's what I like about Hitman, is the actual staples that keep coming back, keep coming back. Because the first one I played was Contracts. Yes, Hitman Contracts. That was the actual title of the game, not a game mode. Uh, then there was Blood Money. Uh, then there was Absolution. But you've always had syringes. You've always had fiber wire. You've always had coins after Blood Money. But to keep it original like that is absolutely amazing. Even though every Hitman game, they change pretty much everything out but it's called close shave because of the proximity and proximity to the target and degree of technique used and you can only wear uh, the board member disguise for all executions now you could run it probably uh, suit only, which I probably will do eventually. But you're not gonna get the points you need if you run it suit only. And I don't think you get suit only challenges on player contracts. So this is my third color. time running this. Uh, short hair with a bright green bag. Sorry. Shit it. She said she'd meet me here. She's probably running late. Yeah. Mm. All right, so we're already starting off at the wrong entry point. But that doesn't matter. Here's one of our targets, though. Actually, I don't think that'll be too bad. I think it might be the the, the same overall distance. But there's a lot of things we can pick up on the way. So I, I don't think the entry is going to be too bad. Maybe lose a minute, maybe gain a minute. It doesn't. Yeah, but it creeps me out how they're different when they leave. Yeah, I'd say they're different when they enter. Come on, you know what I mean. Like they're not quite different. There's another target. And we are going to have a max of five targets again. Uh, that just adds to the degree of difficulty. Ah, my knee is so sore. Why is that? I fell over because the homeless woman suddenly jumped out of the Where is our. Took the wrong turn somewhere. But we might as well pick up this extra stuff just in case. We're not too far off bat. We're just going to have to do this intro shit in reverse.
That's our kitchen disguise. I hope the whole kitchen scenario doesn't go badly. It has more often than not. That's really one of two reasons why I brought the suitcase in. So we picked up two, maybe three melee items so far. Crowbar, which is absolutely necessary. There's another coin. Get a rat poison. I want this to blend it. I want this to blend in really, really well. Hey there, hungry you and go right. And I want to straighten everything out before I move. Now we just need to figure out how not to trigger that guy right there. Cause he does make shit difficult. He's not an enforcer, but he's fucking aggravating. Because if you don't time things correctly, then he'll just stand there. And he'll get in your way and make it so that you can't poison the food until after Pritchard, uh, until after Pritchard fucking sits down, which adds a lot of time. The VIP has access to the kitchen. I'll be waiting for him in the back. Hey, hurry up. The man is starving. Let's go out here so you can trigger this lady's dialogue outside. So that way you don't have to wait to actually get down there. I hope I don't fuck this run up. Because there is a, a large degree of difficulty. Have a nice evening, sir. Sometimes you can just run out the back. Or just curl them out the window but why you can't get spotted so watch out for people back here that almost fucked me a few times but here's our first victim technically the board member is but I'm not gonna kill him yet throw a coin at him. Uh -huh. Now nah, you could just throw it at him or whatever. But if you do that, you will not get the uh, requirement or additional points. Man, I heard something weird. Now, if you don't know, that will be your required exit. Wow.
Okay, that sucked. Um, that means it was somebody on the bridge or the uh, overlook. Okay. Our first failure redoing my contract is uh, out of the way. I'm not even mad at it. Other than, like, there's no suspicion meter whatsoever. They just caught me red-handed. Uh, have you seen a girl around? Uh, short hair with a bright green bag? Sorry. Shit. She said she'd meet me here. She's probably running. Now I and I also have it set up to where the weapon that is required to be used hey, mister. I'm gonna be per elimination hell out of here. is nearby. With the exception of the Tanto really and yeah, the Masamuni. You know what? Nah, I won't do that yet. Rain, rain, nothing rain. Yeah, we can go this way. That's a quicker shortcut. Um. And you gotta be quick about it, because as soon as you walk into the building, it triggers everything necessary. You just gotta make sure you get to this before this guy does. And make sure you do not fucking hit the fucking bell first. Or he will immediately stand in your way. I'm glad there is no enforcers in the kitchen with this disguise. I almost uh, my my original plan for this was to instead of using various weapons just run all weapons uh, elimination as massive Mooney but there's a large degree of difficulty doing it the way I committed to, so. Okay, he's already coming in.
Just make sure you don't kill him beforehand. Just knock him out. No, I'm not supposed to focus where the kitchen feels like a train station. Fine, you're in. Nope. Now I'm going to have to be on a lookout for whoever spotted me from up there. That's the that's the only way. Is even making the contractors shadows of suspicion not enough to affect anything? Now I know for a fact it wasn't the guards because they don't turn around unless they're provoked. Now you can just leave this here, really. You'll no longer need it. I mean, you can if you want to, but... Oh no, I forgot something. Excuse me, I forgot my briefcase in here. Let me uh, go back to the bathroom. Excuse me, excuse me. Guess I didn't bring my briefcase in here. Now the first time I did it, the body was found, but it's an accident, so it doesn't matter. But my second run and this run, um, he wasn't found. So far, like he he was found immediately. Uh, the first time I did it by the kitchen worker, I think. Damn, dude, look at that. That motherfucker broke in half. Okay. So we got our first two kills done and dusted. Um. We'll go for the Tonto. so sore. Why that? And the process of doing that. We will get our third kill. But not with the Tonto. Kept repeating. How did I get here? I don't understand. Now across from the restaurant entrance. There's the apartments over here. There's our scissors. Sir, your breath stinks. 
Your mom's butthole stinks. <laughs> He's like, your breast stinks. Probably gonna eat your mom's ass. So. Now here's the other thing. Actually, I could have brought the uh, suitcase up here. Now, originally, I wanted that guy to be the target. But the way things played out, um, I didn't get to, so I just got the guy next to him. So, either way, we're going to get rid of him. Might as well wait for him to go over there. Grab that brick. Ugh, I bet Gary lost this. Cause I originally wanted him to be the target out of these two, but that would still leave one guy there to fuck up everything. So at, le at least. Him being the first one to move the gun around, uh... Hmm? Lessens the chance of getting spotted. Yeah, Commander, there's some kind of commotion down here. I'm having a look around. Again, come up behind them and eliminate them with the scissors. So our board member requirement for that guy has already been met. That doesn't hide the body. But uh he he'll never be found, so you don't have to worry about that. Got one camera up here, that's it. Don't even need to shoot it. Actually, you can shoot it. Um, but the the first two times, I uh, just used the brick. And the first time I did it to actually make the contract... Uh, I actually went into the whole entire building before I found out on my second run an easier way to get this uh, Tonto knife. Because you literally just have to get up on this ledge and you're right there. Two, five, five, two. You just have to circumvent this enforcer. Who isn't as problematic as I thought. I literally, like the first time when I actually made the contract, I literally had to fucking go through the entire floor to figure out where the fuck it was at. So now we only got two guys left. I don't know how good we will be on timing. We might lose a minute. We might gain a minute. And our other guy is back. Don't forget your suit. for the board member.
and drop the shoes so I don't accidentally use them again. Now this is where the Emmerich gas grenade comes into play. Always be careful of this lady. She doesn't come back through here that often. Like it's not like every minute or every two minutes, more like every five minutes. It just depends on how you get here. But one, it, like if you come up behind her like that, where she just been here, you don't have to worry about her for a while. But you do have to worry about this guy. Although he's sleeping, he can't wake up. So, get rid of him first. And while he's getting sick, you might as well pick up the hobby knife. Make sure no one's around. There you have it. One more guy. Now you could do these any way you want, with the exception of the board member. Uh, this is just the rod I took for the first and second uh, uh, times I did it. Now, the Tonto is illegal, so just keep that in mind. Hey, buddy. Damn it. Careful if the other guy doesn't see you. Okay. Nice. And you might have other interference from uh, people walking into the alley. But so far, I haven't encountered any. And I go back to the restaurant. Now, I don't know if you can go in the back way, but you can definitely walk in the restaurant and go out the back. Let's see if we shave some fucking time off. 
Are you hungry, sir? Yeah, and his body hasn't been found either. Let's see if we shaved off a minute. Our requirements met. We shaved a minute off. And there's close shave, guys. Son Assassin. Stay tuned for more contracts. We'll be back in about 10 or 15 minutes.